Now, I just got punted by this guy. And he, in turn, got hit by this guy, who got hit by this guy. Of course, this all happened. Corner one, lap one. Ugh. But that's not what I came to tell you about today. That was the last race. This is a new race. Welcome to the Kaibo. It is daily race B at Fuji. I really enjoy this track, and I have been doing a lot of racing here this week and uh, in an effort to see if I can uh, improve things around here. So, uh, by the way, please subscribe if you can. I really appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Um, so, we get through this corner, a little bit of mayhem here, some ghosting going on, some of these wide. I gain a few positions. This Valvoline car to my left just kind of gives up, and um, I move up into P4. So, gaining three positions so far on the first lap is all right by me. So, I have been doing a bunch of races this week. I've been not having great success. I usually start out around uh, 12th position, and I end at eighth or ninth. So I've been improving a little bit and gaining or losing just a few driver rating points. I'm not worrying about the driver rating. I'm just going to have some fun and do a bunch of racing because racing is fun. So uh, heading down here, I am just holding my position as we uh, get through the technical part of this track. I really enjoy this part. I think I'm, I'm, I think I'm figuring some things out here. I'm really becoming more comfortable. Going a little wide there, but let's stay with these two. And there's a little bit of smoke here, some non-consensual touching, and I'll take over P3, and I have the slipstream from P2. So let's uh, take it down the straight. Looks like we're gaining some ground as we head down here. Now, I decide, since it's just the beginning of the second lap, instead of trying for the position, let's go get him. I'll help you out here with a little bump draft. Let's go get the leader. He's way up there. I do pull to the inside, not really expecting to take the position, and we get around here safely. I do have kind of a slow exit, though, because I was stuck on the inside there, and as he pulls away, I'm second-guessing that decision to give him a bump draft instead of trying to take the position. But, you know, if he's faster than me, he's faster than me, and let's not fight it out, let's just go for it. And based on my, my success so far this week, a P3 would be just fine with me. Now, we're going to move ahead to lap three. When I finally start to catch up, I think maybe there's a chance something could happen. So... Coming here to the end of P3. And I'm feeling good about it, feeling good about it, feeling good about it. Can't quite figure out what line is best around there, and I have a little slip here. Just a little bit of wheel spin, and that's going to give him a big advantage down the straight, and away he goes, and away go my visions of getting P2. Now, we're uh, starting the final lap here, lap five, and this is where it all happens. For some reason, I don't know why, the first time this week, I missed my braking point here. Jam it down into first gear, and I just slide off a bunch of speed, and the three-second lead I had built over fourth place is starting to dwindle a lot. And goodbye, second place. But second place does this. Oh, you hate to see it, but I will take over P2. I have three and four right on my tail. Got to keep it together for the rest of this race. Everything's going to be fine. Here into the do all your braking in a straight line corner. I mean, they all sort of are, but that one really is. Because you have nothing but trouble if you're still braking when you're turning. And I'll head down here, and, and I, I this happens to me a lot. I don't know if I break too early here, but that puts them right up on my tail. Now we're going to battle this out for the final sector of the track and the final sector of the race. But, yep, I get 
I get tapped there. He's going to do the right thing and, and let me keep the position. That's nice. But his buddy decides to hit me twice. One, two. I go wide here. They both get by me. And then we have some trouble. Final corner. I'm going to take the inside, and I think I have a run on him. It's going to be a great... No. No, 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 no. Another look at this. Okay, I get tapped. He does the right thing by giving me that position, but his friend does not. He gets one tap, two taps, and I'm off wide. But I keep it together. I get this good run on him. I thought I was tapped, but no, there was no contact. It was all me. So from the beginning to the end of the lap, it was me. Yeah, I got tapped, but that happens. That was me. Ah, it breaks my heart. I take it home in P6. Still the best finish I've had all week, but it could have been a P2. It should have been. Oh, no. Well, I do appreciate you being here with me. Again, please subscribe. It would help me out a lot. Uh, I'm looking forward to good times. I want you to be here with them. I'll see you next time.